young man, and I was invited to direct the very last television show of the Alfred Hitchcock Hour. Ero molto molto giovane e venne invitato a dirigere l'ultimo episodio della serie televisiva Hitchcock Hour. The program was in its tenth year. Programma ormai aveva dieci anni. On television. On television. Sì, sì, in televisione. Hitchcock had very little to do with the show. E Hitchcock a quel punto era poco coinvolto nella. All he did was he he would come in one day a week to the studio, and he would read his introductions to these stories. Often idiot, we call it an idiot card. L'unica cosa che faceva è che veniva agli studi una volta alla settimana per registrare l'introduzione al pezzo che poi lui leggeva da quello che chiama il cartelloncino per gli idioti, insomma. Next to the camera. Good evening. Tonight's program. And uh, yeah, you can. How does that translate? I'll just think okay. it was. Uh, Go ahead. Yeah. Uh, this one day, his uh, all of his assistants brought him to meet me, directing on the set, and I was dressed pretty much the way I'm dressed now. In fact, probably the same clothes. Quel giorno lì tutti i suoi assistenti e il suo entourage portarono Hitchcock sul set a conoscermi dove appunto stavo dirigendo questo episodio e ero vestito probabilmente con gli stessi vestiti che ho oggi. And Hitchcock, when he came over to me, I put out my hand and I said, Oh, Mr. Hitchcock, what a great pleasure to meet you. What an honor. E quando Hitchcock arrivò lì, io stesi la mia mano e dissi, ma maestro, ma che piacere, che onore incontrarla, signor Hitchcock. He put out his hand like this. <laughs> as though I was supposed to kiss it. I took his hand and it was wet, it was clammy. Uh, he said, the only thing he ever said to me, Mr. Friedkin, usually our directors wear ta cravatto, ta cravatti. Yes, disse signor Friedkin, di solito i nostri registi mettono la cravatta. Cravatta. Grazie a tutti, dobbiamo... Non sapeva cosa dire, dicevo, oh, me ne sono dimenticato. He was gone. He left. I, I did not see him. Four years later. Quattro anni dopo. I was I received the award from the Directors Guild of America for the French Connection. Allora, quattro anni dopo ricevetti dalla dalla Il braccio violento della legge, dalla Directors Guild il premio per appunto il braccio violento della legge French Connection. The award was huge, gold plate. D'oro enorme. Much like what I'm sure I'll receive. <laughs> I made an acceptance speech. And I see, because it was in a big uh, hall where they served dinner and gave awards on the stage, and down there, people. Many tables were having dinner. Allora eravamo in questo salone dove sul palco ci ci davano i premi e poi giù invece in platea c'erano i tavoli dove le persone stavano cenando. Quindi guardo giù al tavolo chi vedo? I see at a table right down in front 
There is Hitchcock and his family and all of these assistants. Vedo giù e vedo Hitchcock con la famiglia, tutti i suoi assistenti. Now, after you get the award, you're supposed to go off that way and talk to the press. Di solito dopo che ti danno il premio, vieni chiamato al lato e vai a fare le interviste con la stampa. But there were steps leading down to the tables. Ma c'erano degli scalini che ti portavano in platea ai tavoli. I had on an old rented tuxedo and a snap-on bow tie. Avevo, indossavo, quel giorno indossavo uno smoking preso noleggiato con anche un farfallino di quelli che si appiccicano con l'elastico, si fa il toin. Stoin, yeah. Stoin, that's the word. Non ancora con lei, non ci manico un tanto. Stoin? No. So I took my award and I walked down to Hitchcock and I stoined my bow tie right at his face and I said, How do you like the tie now, Hitch? <laughs> Quindi prendo il premio, vado giù per gli scalini, arrivo da Hitchcock, stoin col farfallino. Allora, Hitch. He he looked at me like this. He didn't remember. No amor cor. No amor cor. Non c'è stato un momento amor cor. But I remember four years and to this day. I remember. And so once again, I say, Stoing, <laughs> Signor Hitchcock. No, no. He, I still learn so much from this man, just by watching his films. Nobody needs to go to film school to learn how to make a film. Just watch Hitchcock's films. Quindi, a parte gli scherzi,